Hey, Big Sonic. You know, you know when we're in like um when we're inside of like um in the city center and stuff and we're in a, we're like living in a society or whatever. You know, like can we like affect any type of change? Can we like actually contribute to this type of society and like change things about the society with our uh, opinions and voices and stuff like that? Can we do that, Big Sonic? Well, small Sonic. I, I, I assume that you're now talking about um, voting and stuff and politics and etc and stuff like that. Quite frankly, Small Sonic, our society and city center and all that type of stuff, our civilization, us, us individuals, we don't really, we can't really do a lot to change our overall society and civilization, etc. Even if you vote, your one vote is going to be meaningless because other voters, they're going to outvote you and yours going to kind of get like kind of um sort of diluted out in so many different types of ways. Yeah, but can, are we, can we change our society? I believe we can change like, some type of cultural trends in our society. We can change our culture, but our society and all the laws and regulations and all of that type of stuff, even if we put in our vote, it's not gonna mean a lot anyway, because our votes are, aren't gonna mean anything because we're, we're just individuals and there's like billions of other people and they're gonna like vote as well. Millions, billions, I don't know. Their votes are gonna like kind of dilute out ours and stuff. And quite frankly, we can't really change anything about our society. All we can do is change the culture by like influencing things and influencing people's minds and creating art and music and stuff. But I don't know about it, Small Sonic. Big Sonic, Big Sonic, can we like really um, meaningfully like um do anything like to change our society and stuff like that? I don't know. Can we change the way people think and stuff in their beliefs and stuff? I don't know how society is running, how civilization is running, etc. And so, what do you think about this big Sonic? Well, small Sonic, you can like, again, I guess you can sort of like change, change like how people like think about certain things through like creating like um culture and art and stuff. You can like, you can create music to change how people feel about some things. I don't know, you can like create like pieces of art that affect people's emotions and stuff like that and media and stuff that affects people's emotions. I don't know. Small Sonic, really, but overall, our society and stuff like that is kind of, it's sort of a set in stone. I mean, even if you put your vote in, you're not going to change the laws and the regulations and stuff. You, even if you put your vote in, you're not going to change what type of currency we use. So, quite frankly, I believe, like, caring about our society and its politics and etc. Politics, politics, what does that word mean, by the way? That word means um, something to do with uh, how we organize ourselves in, our, in large groups and, uh, and, of course, our society, how we organize our society. That's what the word politics means, by the way. You should look it up. But we can't really do a lot to, to influence or to change like our society. Everything seems to be set in stone and etc. And so all we can do is like try and like change the culture through like creating art and music and whatever and stuff on our own. So you're saying that our society is sort of like set in stone and stuff and we can't really do anything to meaningfully change it. Are you sure about that, Big Sonic? Well, it's more Sonic. You can try yelling at people and protesting and all that type of stuff, it's not gonna really, the elites and the people who run our civilization and society, they're not gonna really care too much about that. Overall, even if you put your vote in, it's not gonna mean a lot, because your vote, it's just gonna get, you're just gonna get drowned out by the millions of other people. I don't, so, but can we change our society, our civilization, us individuals? I don't believe so, Small Sonic. We can like, we can create pieces of art and music that can change people's emotions. We can change some parts of our culture in our society, but I don't think we can change the laws, regulations, what currency we use. Even if we put our vote in, it's not gonna mean a lot. So politics and stuff like that, Small Sonic, I don't really think it's like, you. it should be like your interest. Big Sonic, are you sure about that? Well, Small Sonic, like you can try yelling at people and blah, 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 and try, it's just kind of impossible. As an individual, your, 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 your opinions aren't that meaningful. You, you cannot do a lot as an individual. Maybe if you become like a very great like influencer, like a celebrity person, you can convince like thousands of other people to believe in your opinions and then you can start to create like some type of change in our society and our civilization and our politics. But until that happens, Small Sonic, as an individual, as, as, an, as a no-name person, as a, as, a, as a person who isn't a celebrity, I don't believe you can do anything to change our society or civilization. Even if you put your vote in, you're just gonna get drowned out by millions of other voters and etc. and stuff and blah, blah, blah. The Big Sonic, surely my vote has to contribute to something, even if it's going to get drowned out. My vote is going to still influence things in so many, like, slight ways. Well, the domino effect, but I don't know too much about it. Overall, I, I believe that our society is set in stone, even if you put your vote in and stuff. 
and blah blah blah. I mean, you're not gonna be able to change what currency we use, etc. If, if as an individual, if you just put your one vote in, maybe like if you convince a hundreds and billions of bajillions of other people, maybe that might create like some type type of meaningful impact. I don't know. I don't know, but as an individual, I don't think we can do a lot to change our society. That's just my opinion, Small Sonic. Well, okay, Big Sonic, I'm gonna go and have a good think about this now. See you later. Bye, Small Sonic. Ooh, politics. The topic of this video is going to be about politics. Okay, why am I talking about politics? Politics. Politics. Why am I talking about politics? Because it's a very um, interesting topic and I'm um, very, like, as a young, as, especially if you're young, if you're like a young man or a woman, you, you, you have like this, you, you feel as if you should care about your society and stuff like this and you should get into like discussions of politics, anything about politics, especially if you're like a young man, young woman, you do get, you, it's almost like, like you get this type of pressure that, oh, I need to like start caring about politics now, now that I'm turning into like a young adult or whatever. And this video is going to kind of help you out with that and stuff, you know, politics, politics, politics. Should you really even give a shit about politics? I'm gonna tell you something like that's, that a lot of people won't tell you about. Should you care about politics? Obviously, you would have to like be sort of sort of like a, a piece of shit to not really care a lot about your society and your civilization and what and what's going on in your country. Obviously, you would have to be, be sort of like kind of um, a dumbass to, to not even give like to not even consider like what's the, the events that are going on in your country, society, civilization. I can go on and on. Politics. So should you care about politics? Obviously, it's all like it's all it's so personal and subjective. A lot of these types of topics are so personal and subjective, in my opinion, at least. Politics. Obviously, what does politics the word mean? Literally, politics is just like thing the like what like like the, the, what's going on in your country, like the the events, like the, all the stuff to do with your society and culture and civilization stuff like that. Should you care about politics? Obviously, it's all so personal and subjective and stuff. In my opinion, to to some extent, you should care about what's going on in your country. Obviously, obviously, you would have to be like some type of massive ignorant uh, read hard to not give any type of uh, fox about your what's going on in your country civilization you'd have to be like some type of piece of shit you just turn a blind eye like you know like, like there's like so many problems in your country you're just you you would have to be like some type of piece of shit okay to just to turn a blind eye okay, i don't care about that you just you're like some pretentious dickhead you just go into your house and you just don't consider about you don't consider or care about anything that's going on around the world and stuff you'd have to be some be some type of kind of cunt and dickhead to, to be like that to, oh i don't give a fuck about like what, what what's going on in my country and my society and civilization and all the problems in my country and society and civilization like homeless people i don't give a fuck like, like people that are die, that are dying of like some type of disease i don't give a fuck you'd have to be like some type of pretentious dickhead no. and I, Obviously, to, to some extent, you, like you can't like it's out of your control. Like so many things that are going on in our world, it's like all beyond our control, beyond your control, beyond your like your influence, beyond your your means to like support and help and to kind of relieve that type of those types of problems. But anyway, politics bring it back to like the, the, the topic of politics. Should you care about politics? Like what? Like in politics, there, like there are just academic definitions to put it in my own words. Politics is basically just like. Like the, the like the, the goings on in your country, and civilization, society, and city, and blah blah blah. Basically, like your civilization, society, politics, kind of relate. It, it, the word itself, it kind of it just relates to like how you, how like you, you you as an individual and like other groups of people in your country and society, how like they like who like like what 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 should happen in that type of way, like who like what what should we agree on and stuff like that, like how do we like. Like make our society better and stuff. What what do we have to like agree on and all these types of things? Is kind of that's what the word politics kind of relates to. It's basically like the affairs of your civilization, society. How people like like contribute to the affairs of your civilization and society and stuff like that. Politics. Obviously, there's academic definitions. Basically, politics it just relates to like this type of concept of like you know the the, the, the affairs of your society and civilization. How people in your civilization and society what what they're up to and how they are how they're like what they're like um agreeing on and stuff like that and their opinions and stuff like that. And how they're running things and regulating things and stuff. Politics. It's kind of it's a very it's so hard to properly like to put it in a nutshell. Politics. Like, I would say it's like to, to put it in a nutshell. Like, I always. You, by the way, you should always like learn how to put things in a nutshell. Like, 
be, don't be like, um, don't speak in paragraphs. Always put things in a nutshell, make things super easy to understand and put things in a nutshell. So many people, like so many YouTubers, especially, I don't know, they, 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 they talk in paragraphs, especially when we're discussing like these types of very advanced topics. Always learn, you have to learn to put things in a nutshell, but politics, if, to put it in a nutshell, politics, basically the affairs of your society and civilization. That's how I would put it in a nutshell. The word itself, it basically means like the, the affairs of your society and civilization, like how the people in your society and civilization, how they're running things and stuff like that. And, and their affairs, like the, the affairs of your civilization and society. And I don't know, okay, what does affairs mean? <laughs> Imagine if you're like a dumbass. I have to just keep defining words for you and stuff. Oh, you, um, to put it in, my, in a nutshell, in my own words, politics, the word itself, it means like the affairs of your civilization, society, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's kind of, I don't want to waste too much time on like, defining words for you and stuff. You can go on to Google and look for the, the uh, more academic definition of poli the word politics. Anyway, but it's basically the affairs of your civilization, society, like, how, like that's basically what it means. Like, how, like the people in your civilization, society, how they're running things and what they're doing and stuff like that. That's what the word politics kind of means and relates to and stuff. Anyway, I don't want to waste too much fucking time on like explaining to you like these types of words, defining words for you and stuff. But politics, okay, so or, or it's like this type of concept that like the affairs of your civilization and society, that's what the word politics means. Okay, so should you like, okay, well, okay, where, what, what are you getting at? Why, why are you like wasting my time? What are you getting at? Because like, the topic of this video is like politics. Should you give a fuck about politics? That's kind of what I'm getting at. Should you really give a fuck about politics? Again, as a young person, you feel this type of pressure that I should care about, I should start now, I need to start caring about politics and voting, all this type of stuff. As an individual, really, you're not gonna like contribute a lot to your overall society. I'm, as an individual, people will be like, what, what are you getting at? I mean, obviously it depends on what you do. I mean, if you're gonna turn into a serial killer and you're gonna like do mass bombings and stuff like this, then you, can, you might be able to influence your society and civilization, obviously in a very bad, negative way. As an individual, like politics, like stuff like that, as, a, as one individual person, you're not going to really sway your society in any type of particular or meaningful way. Are you? As an individual, like as, as one singular person, you're not going to be able to like sway your civilization and society. I don't know. You know what I mean by that? Sway, like... Even if you put your vote in, like, you want to... Like, like, putting your vote in, that's not going to mean a lot because there's like tons of other people, they're going to put their vote in and your vote's going to just get kind of in it, drowned out. So it's kind of like politics. Like... It's kind of it, it, caring about politics. It, it kind of becomes almost absurd, as because as an individual person, as a singular person, you cannot sway your society in, like, in any type of meaningful way. You get it, fam. You get what I mean. You cannot sway your society in any type of particular way. So caring about politics, it becomes kind of fucking um, stupid. Because as like one individual singular person, like what are you gonna do? You can yell at like people around you and stuff. You can yell at people and stuff and you shout your shout at them and kind of scream your lungs out and stuff like It's not gonna, I mean, maybe some people might get angry with you and they're, they're gonna come to you and beat you up. But like caring, like as a singular individual person, caring about politics is kind of so stupid to me because you cannot sway your society at all as a singular individual person. Unless you're like some very, 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 very like famous celebrity like Rihanna, Drake, Justin Bieber, then you can like your opinions start to mean something and you can say stuff and you can get like hundreds and billions like millions of people to follow like, like what you're saying and they can agree to that and they and then these millions of people that love you they can like kind of they can like cause like riots and stuff and that can change your society and you can sway society that's only if you're like a celebrity person if you're like if you're just a typical person like me and like probably most of you watching this video you're not gonna like caring about politics is so meaningless you're not gonna be able to sway your society in any type of meaningful way it's like Putting your vote in doesn't mean a lot because obviously the domino effect, because I do believe in the domino effect because you, you you will slightly change like the, the outcome of your elections if you put your vote in because I, I, of the domino effect. Maybe, so perhaps maybe, I don't know, but still, I, in my opinion, I don't believe, I, I believe that as an individual singular person, you can't really sway your society that much. Can you? Can you sway your society? Can you move your society in, in like a completely different direction as just an individual singular person? Obviously, I'm kind of being a dumbass because we're all different and stuff. And some of us, like, if, if, if you're like a very rare person, like if you're a very popular celebrity, like in Justin Bieber, like who? Could, like, that's, who I, that, that's all I can think about when, you know, in terms of celebrities, Justin Bieber and so he's like, so like, everyone probably knows who he is around the world. That's how popular that guy is. Justin Bieber and stuff like that. He's like, it's gonna, this is gonna be kind of like, kind of sound like very um, like ridiculous, but he's like kind of like you know like you know like um the Prophet Muhammad and Jesus, Justin Bieber. Sort of, he's, he's he's almost like he's almost like in this type of same league as these very um important religious people, religious figures like Jesus, Prophet Muhammad, Justin Bieber. He's kind of like um because if you go around the world, everyone's gonna have a clue about like who Justin Bieber is, just like how everyone has a clue about who Jesus and the Prophet Muhammad is a little bit. 
Anyway, that's kind of off topic, but Justin Bieber, I'm not talking about Justin Bieber, oh yeah. Can you sway your society as an individual singular person? I believe not. Unless you're like a celebrity, unless you're like Justin Bieber, then maybe perhaps you can sway your, you can, you can put like things into motion and you can start to like influence your society in a very meaningful, rich way, but I don't know. Politics, especially if you're like a young person, it's, it, you do feel that it's type of pressure that, okay, I need to start caring about politics. I need to start to give a fuck about voting and stuff. I need to get more mature and care about these things now. As an, indiv like, as an individual singular person, I believe that you cannot really sway your society in, in a drastic, dramatic way, obviously. You can like talk to people and I don't know, and convince some people and stuff. But your overall society, as an individual singular person, you don't really have much control over your society. So politics, kind of caring about politics, it almost becomes kind of absurdly um, pointless and redundant and meaningless and stupid. Caring about politics, it becomes kind of ridiculous a little bit because as a singular individual person, you're not going to be able to sway your overall society. You're not going to be able to to change your society dramatically as just a, as one singular individual person it's, 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 it cannot like change your overall society and culture and civilization it's just a, an individual singular person it's kind of um it's very um kind of hilarious to me that um some people they believe so they as, as, as an individual singular person you're gonna like change like the overall like how like your overall society you're gonna be able to like change your overall society and stuff like that it's kind of stupid ridic really ridiculous i don't know as an individual singular person, you don't you're not gonna be able to like do anything about your civilization society. Obviously if you're a celebrity, you can get like millions of people and you can start riots and stuff and tell them to riot and stuff. Then your opinions are gonna mean something about it all. As like because most of us we're just typical fucking nobodies, like I said, as a typical fucking nobody, because you probably are just a nobody just like me and most other people watching this video. Like we like we're, what we say is not that important. We're not gonna be able to sway our society and civilization in any type of meaningful way. So, so caring about politics is kind of fucking um, very dumb to me, I don't know. Obviously but you, you like, it, well, what am I telling you? Like, but not giving a fuck about the politics, not caring about your society and civilization. That's kind of, that's also very absurd. Cause it's, it's, it's very pretentious and dickheadish and stuff. I don't know. Because like, politics, caring about like what's happening in your country, you can't just be some type of um ignorant dickhead person. You don't give a fuck about like your civilization and society. You just kind of ignore all the problems in your civilization and society. I don't know. And quite frankly, I don't really know. Should you like politics? Because obviously, all of this is very personal, subjective. But you know, as a young person, you do feel like this type of pressure. You do feel this type of pressure that now you should start caring about politics and civilization and stuff like that, and what's going on in the affairs of your country and all that type of stuff. Should you start to care about these that that sort that these types of things? I'm not too sure. Politics, mm. in my opinion, I don't know. Politics, caring about politics, it seems kind of. Again, as an individual singular person, again, assuming you're not like a very, very, like, like one of the, like the top, top level, like celebrity persons, like Justin Bieber, caring about politics is kind of, eh, it's kind of very um, stupid. It is actually, quite frankly, very stupid, caring about politics. Because as an individual singular person, you're not going to be able to sway your society in any meaningful way. You're not going to be able to like, change like, <coughs> how your society and civilization and stuff is running all that, but all these types of things. Caring about politics is so, it's it kind of, it's almost kind of very absurd, but I don't know. Up to you, obviously, I don't know. Should you care about, like, the affairs of your country? Obviously, you should, to some extent. Obviously, it's all, like, within reason. To some extent, you don't, you shouldn't just be, like, some ignorant dickhead person. You just shut your eyes out, you shut your ears away from all, like, from the affairs of your own country and stuff like that, I don't know. <coughs> In my opinion, at least, as a singular individual person, you're not going to be able to sway your society that much. Obviously, if you're like a very important celebrity person, then maybe perhaps you might be able to sway your society and civilization and culture. Yeah, maybe, perhaps. But as an individual, oh, the winds are howling outside. Anyway, as an individual singular person, I don't believe that you can like really sway your society and civilization and culture that much. It's all within reason though, I don't know. Within reason. Perhaps maybe, I don't know, but still, I'm, I'm really trying to like work it out in my head. Because as one singular individual person, like fucking, like you're not, as, unless, unless you're like a politician or like a very top level celebrity person, then you can cause riots, you can tell millions of people something, you can like get millions of people behind you and then they can cause riots and that can, that can help you out. But as just an individual singular person, I don't know, 
your opinion isn't going to like mean anything that much. You're not going to be able to sway your society in any meaningful way. So politics, especially if you're like a young person, you're, you're all like you're very angsty and you're all feisty and something you want to get into politics. You want to start caring about politics and voting and all this type of stuff. I'm not saying that you should not care about politics and voting. I'm just saying that really you're obviously the domino effect. You, maybe your vote might mean something. It might change the event, like the, the outcome of your election in a very slight way. I don't know. Still though, I don't know, but you're, as an individual singular person, you're, you, you can't really like sway your society in any meaningful way. Unless you're like, again, a top level celebrity person or like a very infamous, famous politician. Unless unless that's the case, then maybe perhaps, okay, that's fair enough, that's a little bit different. But if you're like just a typical guy, a typical fucking nobody person like me and you, like me and probably you, as, like most people, like most of us, we're just typical fucking nobodies. Like, well, 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 like, our like fucking on like caring us caring about politics is kind of fucking stupid because like as, again as a fucking nobody and as a, a typical like individual person like singular individual person you're, like, you're not gonna you're not gonna be able to sway your society in any type of meaningful way it's kind of fucking um ridiculous to me i don't know that so many of us we start to care about politics and culture and civil culture and stuff like that obviously i'm not being a dog i'm not gonna be like some type of fucking dickhead person i'm not gonna say they should not care about politics at all I don't know. Obviously, being kind of like caring, not not caring about politics, that's kind of very absurd because you don't like, you don't want to shut your ears and your eyes off from like what's going on in your country and your society. I don't know about politics. Feel like as a as a singular individual person, as a as a as a, as a nobody, as a fucking nobody. Like you can't your opinions and stuff like that. They're not they're not going to be they're not going to mean anything. As a singular individual person. As a singular individual person, as a singular individual person, shoot, got some marks on my nose. As a singular individual person, um, there we are. Come on, freaky face on this side. Anyway, as an individual singular person, you're 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 not gonna be able to sway your society and civilization and culture, and I can go on and on. So important to know this. That as a singular like individual person. You're not going to be able to sway your society in any meaningful way. You can, you, you can, it doesn't matter like what you do, you're not going to be able to like change like, like overall like influence like your society in a very drastic, dramatic way. It's sort of impossible as an individual singular person, unless of course you're like a very top level like celebrity person or you're like a very um top level politician. I don't know. That's kind of a little bit different though. That's just a fucking typical nobody. You're not gonna fucking um, be able to change, like the affairs of your country and the old, like sway your society and civilization in any type of meaningful way. It becomes kind of almost absurd. It becomes kind of almost absurd. It becomes kind of almost absurd. I don't know. As a singular individual person, for you to care about politics and. Because you, you can't sway your society and, and country in any type of way as just one individual singular person. Politics. The topic of this video is politics. Should you care about politics? In my opinion, unless you're like a top level politician or something, unless you're like a top level politician or some top level celebrity person, I, I believe that you, as a typical nobody fucking irrelevant guy or girl, you should not give a fuck about politics because you're not going to be able to sway your society in any meaningful way. Put your vote in, obviously. But you're still, you're just, like millions of other people are going to put their vote and your vote's just not going to mean a lot then, you know what I mean? You can't, as a singular individual person, you cannot fucking um, sway your society, so should you give a fuck about politics? I'm telling you, quite frankly, that politics should not be on your head, in your mind. Just forget about politics, especially if like, you're a young person. It feels like you should care about politics and start. you should start to care about voting. I'm telling you, as a young person, you should just fucking ignore it. Ignore politics. Ignore all of the stuff. Obviously, I'm, I, I, and previously I said that you should not like you cannot, like ignoring like all the problems in your country and society and stuff. That makes you sort of like a dickhead person. But yeah, but it, you, like what, what? Like you can't be a dumbass and think like and and, and you, like, it's like it's like pissing into the ocean. Just because you piss into the ocean, you're not you're not going to be able to turn the ocean like yellow just because you put a little bit of your piss in there. You know what I mean? It's similar to that. Just because you like put your little vote in and you start to like talk talk to your friends about what's going on in your country and society, it's, it's, 
overall your overall you're not going to sway your overall society as as because we're typ as typical fucking nobody pe people persons us like regular people and stuff like that, not top level celebrities top level politicians we what we say and stuff and what we do is not really that important to the overall um, outcome of our civilization and society and stuff and that's I, mean, I don't know it's kind of tragic and stuff and sad that as individuals we, we really can't sway our society and civiliza civilization any, any any type of meaningful way unless of course you're like a fucking um, top level politician or celebrity person maybe that's a little bit different but like as a typical fucking nobody person like like a lot of a lot of us were just typical fucking nobodies we can't really sway our civilization and society in any meaningful way so caring caring about politics is kind of fucking very absurd because you're you're not gonna be able to like change anything meaningfully so caring about politics is kind of if it, it becomes very absurd yeah caring about politics is kind of becomes very absurd i don't know should you care about politics i'm not telling you that you should not give a fuck about politics or voting but i'm telling you that you're as an individual singular person you're not going to be able to sway like sway what does sway mean like move like change like your overall society and culture that's all i'm saying i believe that you should not care about politics too much